Hey guys, this is Frank here with Die Hard RC Addicts, and I got two of my favorite planes that I like to fly. Um, on the ground is the Bird of Prey, and in my hand is the Mini Bird of Prey. These planes aren't made anymore, but they're made out of uh, EPP, and they fly really good. So let's go ahead and get the Mini Bird of Prey up in the air, and afterwards I'll fly the big one. <coughs> Yeah, this is definitely one of the harder uh, planes to film. It's very acrobatic, right, Frank? Yeah, and I even have the roll. Oh, it's 60% right now. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to fly behind you. Haven't flown in a while. Getting used to flying this one again. Yeah, me and Frank are a little bit rusty. But this plane is good for getting your skills back up, though. It is pretty touchy. Like I said, I haven't even put the rates to high yet on my Alon. I mean, on that Elevon. What size battery are you running in this, Frank? Uh, it's a 1550 milliamp, three cell. This one will fly pretty long on that battery. I think I can get about 10 or 15. What minutes. was the motor you had on this one? Um, it's when the was it 3200 kV uh, Wicked, one of the Wicked RC motors. It's a mini, or the junior size one. It's only like a 250 size motor. It's really small, but it worked really. Yeah, good. it seems like this plane moves pretty good. Ooh. It's nice as it doesn't draw a lot of amps, so it can get really good fly times out of this one. I redid the color scheme on the bottom too to make it a little bit better. Yeah, when it was totally white, it was harder to see. Kind of. You ever clocked this one? Uh, I think we clocked it back when Ken owned it. I think it does about 90 top speed. Yeah, one of these days we'll have to stick the uh, GPS in there and see how fast it is. It's fast enough, man. Yeah. It's like ridiculous it's small. as far as the roll in that goes. Right, I think I'm going to swing it way out there and then I'll bring it around one more time. And then okay. Yeah, you're, uh, you're right about four minutes only. Yeah, these things don't like to shed the speed. Cool. Right on. All right, stay tuned. I'll fly the big one next. All right, guys, I got the regular Bird of Prey here. This is the full-size one. It's a 48-inch wingspan. Uh, let's go ahead and throw it up in the air and see how it does. Whistling. <laughs> what motor do you have on here, Frank? This uh, uh Turnigy? Turnigy uh, 2836, the 2350 KV motor, the one that we used to use a lot on our uh, scratch fields plane. And that's on a 3S pack? Yeah, and a 6x4 prop. Um, this is actually a pretty heavy plane, it's close to 30 ounces, or it might actually be over 30 ounces. It's all EPP. And it's funny because uh, the nose actually has a lot of lead in it because originally this was designed to fly off of a brushed motor with a NICAD battery. So it's got about at least six ounces of lead in the front <laughs> to get it to 
the CG to balance out right. Now I got a brush of setup in there with a lipo battery. These planes, I think, were originally designed for combat. And uh, according to Ken that owned it before me, he said these planes were like hard to beat because they're just so maneuverable. Yeah, those things are very aerobatic. Oh, I just like the way it looks in the air. It's yeah. awesome. I love forward swept wing plane. Just like the little one, this one likes to glide forever, man. Yeah, these are two of my favorite planes. Um, I may be working on a top secret project here, um, <laughs> sort of like a forward swept wing similar to this. So keep your eyes open for it, guys. It might be coming out here pretty soon.